Hey, what's up everybody? Rod J back again. Thanks for swinging by to check out another video. So tonight I'm actually going to try one from out of Louisville. This is actually from Fall City Beer. This is their classic Pilsner. On the back side, there's some writing there. I'm not going to read all of that, but if you want to pause and freeze, and you want to read that, that's definitely there for you. But this comes in at 4.5% ABV. And I don't believe they noted anything on here with the IBU. They do note on there, as you can see right down on the bottom, the independent label. Let's go ahead and get this one open and get it into a glass. See what it has to offer. Heard a lot about these guys i've seen some of their beers around started getting distribution from them probably about six or seven months ago at a few places i saw and just decided to finally pick it up and uh figured i'd try some lagers and uh see how i like this one as well since i've done a few other ones and this one actually as you can see has a little bit of a a chill haze on there you're not used to seeing it on a lot of the lagers you're used to having that kind of clear look there a lot of good clarity but look at that head head came out very nice with a two finger head and this one is an all grain beer as they note that on the uh the can itself but it does have a golden straw color albeit it is hazy you can pick out some of the carbonation taking place but if you can see the bubble streaming action from the carbonation there the head itself sits up nicely that's pretty much a White head is down to a finger now, came out of two fingers, so the pour was right on point for where it needed to be. As far as aroma, it's got your typical lager type smell. You're getting yeasty, you're getting a little bit of a breadiness in there. Now on the back end, it does have a little bit of a funkiness as well. A little bit of a hop action in there on the back end. Kind of interesting, it's almost got like um, that grain really coming out very nicely to provide that nice grain aroma but that's kind of what I'm picking up there let's get the taste it's almost like a nice sweetness that I'm picking up nice graininess from the grains that were used sits in the mouth nicely definitely a little bit more of that breadiness in the taste went down very easily on the back end very smooth to drink got a nice little quality to it for a refreshing type feel almost a little grassiness in there as well but then I'm starting to pick up a little bit more of that grain action again a little bit of a I want to say it's almost like a, it's a corn type feel the back end with the uh, slight bit of a hop feel kind of reminds me of something that you would get like in a Heineken where you're picking up a little bit of that hops not very strong but it has enough of it that it does come across there in the back of the taste nice crisp feel on the end as well pretty decent if you want to go local and you want to uh just grab a nice refreshing lighter type beer the body on it is pretty light goes down real easy you can easily sit back and chug through a six pack of these not that i'm saying you should go out chugging a bunch of beer just saying you can go through these rather easily so this again is the falls city beer four and a half percent abv it is their classic Pilsner. If you've had it before, let me know what you think. Put some comments in the comment section. But it, it does what it's intended to do. Not a bad logger. Thanks again for swinging by and check out another video. Hopefully you like what you saw. And if so, please remember to hit that like button. And of course, if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you subscribe for other videos as they take place. I'll look forward to catching you guys next time. Keep drinking that good crap beer. Remember, there's always time. Get your beer on. Cheers.